1945 Scammel Scammel trailer coupling spring. Here's me bits of uh, steel now ground up and ready to, to weld up well together. That's the uh, leaf spring there and that saw blade that I've just cut up is a nice bit of carbon steel which I'm just going to use to 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 kind of pad out the uh, spring the uh, leaf spring because it's not very thick. So I'm just going to weld that on. So I just want to line them tops up put a tack of weld on. I'll do that while I'm just waiting for the foist to get up to temperature. Right, I'll just go and clean them up now with the grinder them sides and I'll put the metal into the forge. So I've got my uh, got my metal up to temperature. I'm just going to form the hoop.
finally got the steel ready for forging. Um, the, these are the the hoops I made or the eyes for the axe. And you can see the <coughs> spring steel in the center and then them two bits of saw blade just sandwiched on there and I've put a few weld tacks on this here and there just hold it all together when it goes into the forge uh, it just stops it all kind of sliding and moving about which can be a pain in the neck and I think I'm probably going to weld a handle on these now as well because it's easier than trying to grab it with the tongs because I've only I've got the tongs I've got aren't really suitable for this I need to get some more tongs but uh, I'm going to weld a handle on because I can hold the work steadier with a welded handle anyway so I'm going to fire the forge up now and I'm going to beat these to death and shape the axe out of them okay, so I've welded them bars on there I'm going to just get these in the forge now Billets are just about up to temperature uh, and I'm going to gently tap them now just to force the layers slightly gently together. I've had borax on them. I've just finished bashing the, the axes and that's what we've got ended up with just flared, flared that side out and what I do now is I need to grind that get a grinder on it and grind the shape into it you can see it's already pretty thin ready for grinding the one exactly the same quite long these as well I'll be, taking, I'll be cutting them off around about there somewhere.
heat treats. that up and temper it back a bit. So that is it. I uh, have tempered the blade back a bit because as it comes out of the forge and has been treated it's way too hard, it's very brittle. So I've, uh, I've, I've given it some heat and I've tempered it back so the rock weld will probably be around 55 on it now. You can see the layers now in this, you can see the layers of steel, uh, the mild that form the eye, and the, the, the spring steel down the centre and them two layers of carbon steel in that. You see that again there. And you can just see some patination in the spring steel there where it just comes through. And that's it, it's a nice little axe and it's a good weight. Uh, and I think for a while that'll be me doing axes. I've got some other projects now that I want to get going on. So uh, that'll be my last axe for a while. Thanks for watching fellas. Um, please subscribe and like if you like. And leave us a comment. And I will see you in the next video. If you want to see me putting a shaft on this or a haft. I'll put the I'll put a link there because I've already done a video on that. Okay, bye for now.